And it just, it just breaks my heart so much. It breaks my heart because she is so unbelievably talented. Yo, what's up everybody? Before we do start this video, I'd just like to mention, please stick around until the end of the video so you can hear out all the key points that I have to make throughout the video. video. Exploring Blackpink June 10th of this year. Yes, 2020. I was 100% late to the party when it came to Blackpink, but that was part of my own personal ignorance. I always kind of brushed K-pop aside until I explored K-pop and now I'm in love. When I tell you Blackpink is everything, I mean Blackpink is everything. This video is about a specific issue that I have experienced throughout my Blackpink journey. Not only have I experienced this, but a lot of other content creators have and just normal music listeners have experienced the same issue. I recently got a YouTube comment on my YouTube channel that made me think so much about my videos and my journey with Blackpink. The YouTube comment reads, his evolution with the four members has been so heartwarming to watch. So I to see many Blackpink YouTube reactors doing what he does and appreciating all four members. This comment took me back quite a bit simply for the fact that I didn't start this YouTube journey and this, this Blackpink experience appreciating all four members. After reading that comment, I looked back at all of my Blackpink YouTube videos from the start to the end again, and I realized a pattern. My introduction to Blackpink was the music video and the song Do 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 Do. And in that video, I had no idea who the members were. I was new to Blackpink, I didn't know any of their names. I was just unbelievably blown away by the visuals and just the song. It's a bop, their vocals, their looks. I was blown away. And then we move on to Kill This Love. I start learning the names of only two members. This is the root of the problem, and this is why I'm making this YouTube video. I've spoken to many people about this, and they've said themselves that when you come into Blackpink, the names that really stick out to you at first is either Lisa or Jenny. And as soon as I heard that from people, I was like, wow. When I started my YouTube journey, of course there were people teaching me about all the members, but my YouTube comments are mainly filled with Lisa and Jenny. Well, were mainly filled with Lisa and Jenny. Now, if you look back at all my videos, you start noticing that all of a sudden I go from not knowing any of them to only talking about Lisa, Jenny, Lisa, Jenny, Lisa, Jenny. And then Lisa becomes my bias and then Jenny becomes my bias. And like every day I keep switching between the two. Leaving out the incredible talented Rosé and Chisu. Then we get to the halfway point of my reactions and at this point everything starts to switch. We reached the halfway point of my Blackpink reactions and this is when things started shifting and if you watch my reactions from start to finish you really notice a shift and this YouTube comment is what inspired this entire video because I personally didn't notice the shift like everything just happened so naturally and this is the changing point for me. This is when I started really 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 noticing Jisoo and Rosé. I fall in love with Jisoo. I fall in love with her so much and Rosé. And then it gets to the point where I fall in love with all four members. But especially Jisoo. She has such a special place in my heart. Especially her personality. Her per you guys, the amount I can relate to her personality is unbelievable. And just her overall talent is just so incredible. And I wish that it was something that I noticed from the start. I'm proud to say right now as a Blink, okay, I've inserted myself in the Blink Nation that I love all four. My bias is all four. And I'm not saying you shouldn't have a bias. Everyone has a bias. You know, some days you you feel like <laughs> you feel like Lisa, other days you feel like Jisoo, you know what I'm saying? Like, it, it's fine to have a bias. What I'm simply saying is Blackpink wouldn't be Blackpink without all four of them. The reason why I'm making this YouTube video is because soon Blackpink and Selena Gomez are releasing a track. And there's gonna be a lot of new reactors that haven't reacted to Blackpink and love Selena Gomez that are gonna react to this song, possibly fall in love with Blackpink. I mean, if you don't fall in love with Blackpink, I don't know you. Like, how do you not fall in love with them? To those YouTubers who do end up falling in love with Blackpink and then start exploring Blackpink, I don't want them to just be introduced straight away to Lisa and Jenny. I want them to be introduced to all four members straight away so they can experience 
what I missed out. Looking back at the older music videos where I literally never mentioned Jisoo at all or Rosé, I look back at them now and I'm like, what? Are you kidding me? Like, I get frustrated with myself. If I were a YouTube creator planning on reacting to Blackpink for the first time, just like I did, or if you're just a simple music listener, listening to Blackpink for the first time, excited for the Selena Gomez release with them, then I suggest that you don't do what I did because I ended up missing out so much. Like, I was just thinking to myself, I was like, imagine if I knew all of their names from the start. Right, imagine if I paid attention to all four members from the start. Like, I would have fallen in love even more. But I'm grateful that I understand that now. To the new creators and the new listeners to Blackpink, please pay attention to all four members from the start. Trust me on this. Because unfortunately, there's a high chance that you, from the start, are really only going to learn and stick with two names. And I've noticed that's been a pattern, especially like looking throughout all these Blackpink videos from other creators before making this video I was watching. And from the start, you know, they really only learn Lisa and Jenny, Lisa and Jenny. And then down the line, they learn Rosé and Jizu. Um, so, like I said, if by any chance you're watching this, pay attention to all four. They are so incredible. So, so, so incredible. And it's better for you to pay attention from the start than down the line. Because trust me, trust me, you will miss out if you do not pay attention to all four members. I don't know how far this video is going to reach. Realistically, I really don't know. But what I do know is that you guys are so incredible. You viewers watching right now, you are incredible. And we can do something about it. And I've already actively started. To those creators that are reacting to Blackpink, that, you know, are new to Blackpink, and they're, they're not noticing all four members, go into the comment section and simply upvote the comments that mention the members that don't mention. So those comments go up more, so the creators can read about it. Like I said, I'm making this video simply out of love because I, I, got, I got emotional, I have to be honest. I got emotional because I was just like, yo, I missed out on just like, oh my god, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not about, <laughs> I'm now getting emotional, <sighs> okay, oh my gosh, I, I was, I didn't mean, I didn't, I didn't intend on this, <sighs> it's just, I've seen, I've seen the mistreatment. I've seen Jizu's mistreatment and it just it just breaks my heart so much. It breaks my heart because she is so unbelievably talented. And the fact that as a creator myself and I was looking back at my other videos and I just I just didn't pay attention to Jizu Jizu whatsoever. It just breaks my heart. Seriously, it just does because I I could never imagine I said I wasn't gonna get emotional, man. I just want I just want new people to see how valuable all four of them are. Like all four of them are just so 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 important. Because without all four of them, there wouldn't be any Blackpink. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video right now because I do not like being emotional on camera. I was expecting, you know, I had more to say, but I think I've, I think I've said what I had to say. Um, and yeah, I really hope that all four are valued by new creators that come in with this new release that have never heard of Blackpink. And they're going to explore Blackpink for the first time. I really hope that they appreciate all four members. And learn from... My mistakes, you know? Learn from, you know, the fact that... I missed out on so much. I don't want you guys to miss out on that, okay? You, you, you start watching and focusing on all four from the start. Trust me. Trust me, you'll thank me. Trust me, you'll thank me. But anyways, guys, that is it for this video. Like I said, I was really inspired to make this video because I... Before this video, I was getting emotional. I was looking through my, my older content. It just hit me. It hit me so hard. But I'm so glad that you can see my progression throughout 
this journey, this music video journey. There's still many, there's still a lot of songs that I haven't heard, but for the music videos, I've done all the music videos, and I just love how, although my journey isn't necessarily what I wanted it to be in terms of, I should have noticed all four from the start, but I'm happy the fact that my progression goes from, you know, only noticing two to becoming a stan of all four and realizing that none of this wouldn't, none of this would be possible without all four members. Without